everyone. I'm Lieutenant Derek Lewis with the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office. I would like to thank everyone for coming today. We are here to talk about a violent business robbery that occurred here at the ABC Liquors located at 1143 South Lane Avenue. The robbery occurred on Monday, July 2nd, 2012 at 10.55 p.m. Our investigation revealed that an unidentified black male wearing all black clothing with a black t-shirt wrapped around his face entered this store. He approached the counter with an AK-47 type rifle. The suspect jumped over the counter, demanded money from the employees. The suspect violently took money, grabbed some liquor off the shelf, and fled out the door. North Florida Crime Stoppers would like to talk about a reward that has been put up for this case. I would like to now introduce to you Executive Director of North Florida Crime Stoppers, Wiley Hodges. Thank you, Darrell. Uh, let me correct you first. It's the first Coast Crime Stoppers. Uh, you know, as he stated, we're here today to talk about another crime which has occurred in the city of Jacksonville. You know, normally we, we would appeal to the, the public uh, and, and trying to get some information on this, but I think the public pretty well knows how Crime Stoppers works. I want to take a little different approach this morning. I want to talk to all the street thugs and the duck dealers that are out there on the street today. Let this be a wake-up call. Let this be a wake-up call. And particularly, I want to talk to the suspect involved in this case. You know, it, it doesn't take much of a man to walk into a store, stick a gun in someone's face, and demand their money. It does take a man to do the right thing. You know, I'm appealing to the suspect this morning. Turn yourself in. Turn yourself in the police and do the right thing. If you decide not to do that, now I'm talking to your friends and your so-called cohorts. You know, as of today, as of this moment, I'm offering a $6,000 reward on your head. Trust me, your friends aren't that friendly. They're going to turn you in. Someone's going to call about this. To your friends out there, I can tell you, you know who it is, you know where he lives, you know where he hangs out, and you're going to call us. I know you are. For $6,000, any and all of you could use the money. I know that I could. We'll be expecting the call. And again to you, Mr. Suspect, I'm sure that we will see you soon because your friends are going to turn you in. $6,000. On top of getting the $6,000, I guarantee, guarantee 100% anonymity. No one will know who you are. No one will know that you turned them in, even if you're his very best friend, unless you tell them. Call us. Let me give you the information. You can call us at 1-866-845-TIPS. 1-866-845-TIPS. You can get a hold of us on the internet, www.fccrimestoppers.com. I'm expecting the call. I know that we'll be getting it. Mr. Suspect, you better be looking over your shoulders. All the rest of you street thugs, we're sick and tired of the crime in Jacksonville. We're sick and tired of having to come and do these types of reports. And we're going to do something about it. There's a bounty on your head. We're going to be paying people to put you in jail. Thank you. Very good. Thank you. I'm trying to get away with $800. Pardon? I'm trying to get away with uh, The approximate value, including the alcohol, is about $1,250. Turn them in, you're doing a lot better off. <laughs> That's right, much better off. Let me uh, introduce a couple of people. In addition to the, the uh, original $1,000 that Crime Stoppers uh, puts out on these, ABC Liquors has, has stepped forward. They're sick and tired of their place of being robbed, too. They've put up $5,000. Uh, they're tired of it. They want this guy incarcerated, as do we. Uh, there's a lot of ABC liquor stores around town. This guy will be apprehended, and we thank you all for coming forward and putting forth the additional $5,000. It's a shame that you have to put that to get someone put in jail. However, we know money talks, and money is going to talk in this case, and I feel good about this thing being solved very, very soon. Is this suspect uh, suspected of any other robberies? I mean, is there any indication that this individual was involved in others? I'll have to turn that over to the uh, lieutenant. We suspect maybe one. We suspect maybe one similar case. 
Uh, this is a Hess gas station on Normandy Boulevard, but the video is, uh, is not good enough to do, make that determination for sure. It's very similar. Hess so, station where was that, I'm sorry? Hess on Normandy. When was that? Uh, June 30th. We'll get you the report. Same type of ammo gun, same gun. It's very simple. Everything is pretty much, the MO is exact, almost. Just the video can't really confirm it. So we're guessing lives in this area. Uh, that would be a good guess. So he came in here, did he hold anyone kind of hostage or anything in getting the money or what? Well, with that kind of assault rifle, we, we call it a hostile takeover kind of robbery, you know, putting the, in, them in fear of the victim. So uh, he didn't really, I mean, I think he told one victim that we didn't want your money, specifically the, the employee, just the business money. There were customers in the store? No, just the employees. Just the employees. It was right after, eight minutes after closing, I think, somewhere around that time. Did he lay them down on the ground? And, is that what I was reading it real quick? Uh, yes. One and then one employee was laid on the ground. Yes. Sir. Okay. As an officer, if, some, if someone does, if this guy does it again, or anybody does that, what do you suggest that a person that works in the police? Do? We just suggest that they do exactly what he asks. And, you know, that's the best thing. Don't be a hero. It's just money. You know, it can be replaced, but no lives can be replaced. Any other questions? Okay. So just to double check, you said five hundred and five thousand. Which one was it for sure? The ABC liquors. The ABC Liquors gave an additional 5000 and 5, Crime Stoppers is giving 1000 which is a total of $6,000 okay, for this guy. Got it. All right. You guys usually give 1000 right? I mean, that's mm -hmm. what it is. All right.